Well, that was a huge distraction, and now timer's gonna look a little different. I'm almost, <laughs> I'm almost certain you guys are gonna be confused. Is this running at good frames? Doesn't look like it. <laughs> so this is Quimpact with Let's Play. Get ambushed by an enemy and have instantaneous burst. Why not? See, why is it saying that now? Like, ah, oh, eyeball demon. Um, I want to say poison on him. We'll get rid of him first because he's the huge threat. So eyeball demons and power demons are the worst health, like they're the worst class of demon you can fight in this game. Hands down the worst. All right, so the horror eye is probably weak to poison. I want to say he is, but let's try explosive on him just in case. You know, if Venok isn't working, we're, we're gonna use Explosion, because Explosion's a good counter substitute. It's a, it's a countermeasure. Um, I really don't know who to prioritize to kill here. But on the one hand, I should have killed the Ogre first. Yeah, Explosion's the bigger, it's the bigger damage. Should've seen that coming. I should've killed the Oni on the left, the A-slot demon, I mean the Ogre. The Axe Ogre can do a lot of physical damage, and is not fun to deal with. You weak to fire? I forget. Ah, I forget what you're weak to already again. Well, I... Let me talk about the distraction here. So, right now, it's a little weird going on, you know, in, when you're trying to, um... How do I phrase this? When you're in open communication for your, for your job, and, you know... You get a message in the middle of the night because there's a lot of panic over something that's that's gone down and happened, and you get asked a lot of questions. It's almost like an interrogation. It was dead of the night, and um, they're really just trying to figure out what kind of digital signature was going on. Let's let's put it like that. Like, who was the last one to tamper with things on a drive? And uh, it was definitely not me. Is the funniest thing because. Um, I actually haven't accessed the drive in a while because I've been, <laughs> due to health circumstances, I've been behind on my work. So never get behind on your work, folks, especially when you're working for something that yet you, you know you could tip of a needle lose your job. Don't 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 do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. So you know. It's really awkward, especially too when you're communicating to something to someone, and then the language barrier can get in the way. Is the weirder thing. I know, I know. You're gonna be like, "Well, you speak very, very good English. You're very good. You you speak it basically fluently." Yes, thank you. Who knows this? He's very he's very aware that he speaks it fluently. But he doesn't speak it good. Point is. You're gonna see the save timer when we reach a save point, and you're gonna go, Oh shit, a lot of time has happened, <laughs> and I plan to not have that happen. I, find, I found it to be a funny enough story to let you in on it without as many details as- I have to withheld a lot of details, you know. But Jesus. <laughs> I'm having heart attacks. Skumpco. Oh, right, I can't. I can't go back. That's what I was doing. I was doing Lottery Dungeon. Desert Hall Floor 3 takes me back to 1. So this should take me to... Middle? Yes. Wait. Yes. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Hey, but good news is I got that kink out of my throat. You know, you just had to pound it in and, you know, sound upset for a little while. Oh, boy. It was just stressful, and I figured, hey, you know, maybe if I told somebody about it, as in the entire internet, it'd be fine. I'm just trying to forewarn people. You have an important job. Well, my job's not that important. I'll be real with you. If you're the guy who holds responsibility for things like the ledgers, and you're right below the dude who makes the style guide, you shouldn't fuck up the drives. Even if it was not you. You, nobody should have messed up it. You know, humans make mistakes. That's the whole point. But you know, companies, they don't want to hear that. They just don't want to hear that. that, that that's just a, a nature of life. Nature of life, everybody. You know I'm a peaceful, loving pirate. 
Am I still going with the whole bit that I'm a, a catfish jellyfish? Catfish jellyfish hybrid who is both mechanical and angelic? Was, was that was the full anime bit? Was that my anime backstory? Can somebody tell me what my anime backstory was? I can't remember. Who Impact doesn't remember his anime backstory. So if I seem a little exhausted, I apologize. Again, it was a high stress, high strung moment. It was something I didn't want to say. I uh, blew up my uh, phone, that's for sure. <laughs> In the digital age, this is just how jobs work. I swear. I bless every single one of you. Everyone. Everyone. Many, many good tidings and high, high wishes for the holidays at this point. The holidays are probably passed by the time this gets up. But n neither here nor there. All of you out there who are working on the front lines, I I can't I can't imagine. I just Wimpack can't can't do it anymore, man. All right, they're not shouldn't be using ice against them. Explosion! Right, thought I was fighting. See, I'm a little out. I'm a little out of it. So I apologize if this video seems a little weird. I like giving you the proper explanation, though. You know, I know it's probably none of your business. But hey. This is what Ku Impact does. These is these is real raw moments. These LPs aren't you know fake bullshit. That's what it tells you. Not to say that most other LPs aren't fake bullshit, but come on, you know a lot of people do write a script to keep their head in the game. This this shit's off the script. Never was on a script. There's no goddamn script. Once in a while, okay, there was a script for when I was doing it in Italian, but I wanted to make sure that I didn't mess it up. I wanted to make sure that I knew what I was talking about. But they didn't keep a script, and I didn't know where I was going, man. You listen to me, man. Impact just wants to get to the boss. You know, because here in Past Town, compared to present when this gets uploaded, you know the holidays are in the days because you've seen. Well, I just personally. Personally, I'm I'm not too. It's not a big deal for me. Uh, let me put it like that. <laughs> but there are other people. There are other people that it's a very big deal for. I didn't find any chests, by the way. I think this has just been all raw done. Well, do we fight the boss now or do we grind out burst? Uh, how many battles until burst? We just had a burst. I think we could grind out burst. That way we can start the next video and fight the boss. I'll be in a little bit of a better mindset, I'll calm down. I'd rather kill some enemies, you know. This guy... Why do they all say that? What have I done? What have I done? In my first playthrough, I swear the monsters weren't saying that shit. No, explosion, what am I doing? Get back here. We're gonna throw some explosions out at this guy. Maybe poison. I just want the lag to stop. I wish that the computer could not run at like chugs per second. Oh yeah, burst. Let's get burst. I know I'm skipping level ups, but come on, you know there's gonna be a ton of them. Grinding out burst. Grinding out burst. Gonna need that burst to beat the guy. Because, uh, honestly, there's a super huge chance I'll die if I don't fight him in burst. I can't even remember what his weakness was, but I want to say it's water. Yeah, what the fuck? I, it says it every time now. I think I've really pissed the monsters off. I think I've done it. I think I've really done it now. Can I poison some of these guys? If I can get some poison out there, please. That way, uh, Beloy doesn't die. Beloy might die just because these guys hurt. And he can do a lot of damage. You know what? Start focusing you. You, Dana. You kill. This is strategy time. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about.
Got a tea. Oh, I actually drank my tea. Oh no! Man, Koo's got nothing going for him right now. And <laughs> nothing but bad luck. You know? After the holiday season was going smoothly this year. Uh, <laughs> other than the one other incident. You know. We don't talk about the other incident. It never happened. Nope. <laughs> I don't know if all of you know what I'm talking about, but I know some of you, if, if I get subscriber views, because there's a lot of people, non-subscriber views, man, I love it. So welcome to the channel, welcome to the, uh, this is the train wreck episode, I, I came into this in the wrong mindset. Just trying to have a fun time LPing a game in my free time, and then my free time becomes work time. You never go to sleep. You never stop working for the machine. <laughs> That's the old grind. I'm sure everybody understands. It's the silly things in life, I tell ya. So also, we're grinding out first. I'm sure you've heard me earlier in the video say this. We're grinding up. Can't possibly take forever. Where are the monsters? Well, yeah. I don't want to go that way. Hell no. Monsters. So, I don't know how the encounter rates exactly work in this game. Sometimes it feels like I can run forever and never get an encounter. Sometimes I just get an encounter, like, two freaking seconds. And it's like, well, what am I supposed to do now? Die every 10 minutes? I want the fire guy dead. Super hard. Yeah, I knew he wasn't going to die. They have a lot more health than their counterparts. I'm dealing that much damage and they're still not dead. Oh wait, these guys weren't stunned, but they were looking down upon me? Wow, Dana has no defenses. Beloy took less damage? What? What? I'm pressing X to Dow? Game? Well, I'm gonna use the heal magic after this fight, you know, so we're not dead into the get. Like, against the next ogres, we won't be dead. That is, is uh, if we survive the current ogre. I'm not sure. I really don't know why it's saying that all of a sudden in every fight. Did we glitch it? Did we break it? Because there's supposed to be a more whole time. Because if that's what he's been hinting at, I feel bad. Oh, come on, boy. Don't die on me. Quimpec needs you alive so he can, you know, super Thera you. We're gonna, we're gonna Thera you right after this fight. Unless you level up. Didn't. Well, I don't want to chance it. You're getting thera -ed. Yep. Time to use magic. SO, please. Luna Thera. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Where's Dana? Cool. That's good enough healing. I mean, now if we encounter anything big and bad, we won't die in one hit. Yeah, no. They, I, apparently, everybody just hates me now. Oh, fuck. Again. Thinking he's fire when he's weak to explosion. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it like nine times. Break him. Missed. Okay, so a good way you can tell you missed is the animation plays and no coloration happens to the sprite itself. Now you're critical striking me. So if there's no coloration to the sprite itself like that, then that means you did not land your damage. Which means you're crying, because that's a waste of mana and no dead guy. No guy who is completely dead. I still didn't level up after that fight. That's great. And I'm almost out of time, so this has been Quimpact with Let's Play A Witch's Tale. I do apologize for this episode's uh, melancholy neambarance. Uh, I really wish to... 
You know, I really wish that that didn't happen, but it's okay now for the most part. And it only took me a couple hours to fix. <laughs> so it's okay. But, um, yeah, next time we'll fight the boss. Because we're still not in burst. I seriously hate how all the enemies are looking down upon me. Does that mean they get better crits? I thought about that. I think that means they are actually at an advantage. Huh. Well, I'll see you guys all next time.